guys welcome back to my channel and hello if you're new i'm leona and i have a service dog in training named athena who's laying down on that side of my bed so you guys can't really see her but you can find videos about her all over my channel um i'm gonna apologize for looking like a hot mess in this video but i can't wait any longer um i got a really great uh package today so this is just the package it is a harness from dino dog gear on instagram i'll leave them like their instagram in the description box if i can get it linked then i'll do that but if not then i'll just leave the username um and have that in there i have not looked at it i went ahead and opened the package because i really struggle with these envelopes and getting them open so i wanted to cut it off camera but it's there and open but i haven't seen anything i've seen pictures that they sent me but that's it um so yeah I wanted to go ahead and do this unboxing on my channel and then I do have a second harness coming that if you guys want a second unboxing you can request it in the comments and I will record that. If you don't want a second unboxing also let me know but if you want a review let me know on that because they are a smaller company that just started and I feel like doing a review that says like my likes dislikes can let people know if it's a good company to go for. Um, so yeah. Uh, what I can say now is personally their customer service is absolutely amazing. Like I'm absolutely in love with them I haven't even seen like the quality of their harnesses yet, but I like adore them and I Love like the owner of their company like they're amazing and just they really care about their customers So is that kind of thing? Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do this unboxing and I hope you guys enjoy All right, so they did a package in a package um so i like this like yeah this material on here is amazing it's so cute. okay i might have to no okay so yeah i still get the um pleasure of watching you open a package i guess okay so starting off they sent a little goodie bag thing in here um so let's see i got some candy. They gave me some business cards. So this is just their business information for anybody interested. Um, they do not have a website yet, but I think they're working on one. If I remember correctly, I'm not 100% sure on that. I also got a cute little pumpkin eraser. And then I got a sticker that just says Dino Dog Gear. And then a little letter that just says like, thank you for your support, heart dino dog, trick or treat, happy Halloween. And I love that they're all handwritten. Like I feel like, I personally just feel like a little bit more special when like companies do handwritten notes over doing like the mass print because they just type it up and then they print out like 50 of them and put it with every single one of their orders and there's not much customization. Um, I know like, so what co does like a printed card, but they also like do a handwritten letter on one side. And that's something that I'm like, Oh, like you actually like, you took the time to write something to your customer. And that just makes me feel so special. Um, okay. So, okay. This is a traffic lead I got from their pre-made sale. Um, so what happened here <laughs> is I ordered the brown one they accidentally sent me an orange one. I think they just mixed up the packages. And the response to that was, oh, I'll package this with your order. And then they had me keep the orange one, which I was like, you know, thank you. I would have sent it back. But it still was like, you know, that's really nice. Um, so, yeah. Anyways, it's just a short black traffic lead. I personally prefer traffic leads. I think I've touched on that a little bit. Wait. So now the harness. Um... So I did get a mobility harness, um, which I've touched on why I get mobility uh, harnesses now. Athena is over a year old. She's almost a year and a half, so I feel a lot more comfortable getting ones fit to her. And this is so pretty. Oh my gosh. Okay. So first off, here's our pool strap. I did get white and gold because I thought it would be really pretty. And then I did brass hardware because I thought the gold and the gold would look really nice together, and I was right. Like, they're obviously different golds, but they're still gorgeous. Um, so yeah, this is the pull strap. This is 12 inches, I believe. 
so it'll be about six inches off her back when in use um which is good for me and yeah so it's like really great I like how it's thick I'm gonna have to put a um probably a sheepskin cover on the counterbalance handle but the pull strap is nice like I really like this I might get a matching white one so if I want a day where there's like more white or I guess I could just like put that side out that's nice because I can just like switch it up maybe I don't think that they've got a design like it anyways it's something to explore all right and then here's the actual harness so I did get an attached um counterbalance handle I believe it's seven inches if I remember correctly um Athena's in that range where we can get away with six inches for a semi-rigid counterbalance handle but seven to eight inches is more comfortable for me um just because it gives me a little bit extra movement I guess I don't know what to call it but it's like it it's like areas I could rest his my hand on his back but I preferred a three inch handle um so it's that kind of thing and it just kind of depends on the person um so I don't know if I said it's a biothane yeah they're biothane but this is the harness it's white and gold uh I got yeah as I said I did a semi-rigid handle so it's an attached handle versus detached I did get like cape rings also so I can put that on there um they're not uh whatchamacallit they're not padded which is one of my like one things that I kind of prefer but Athena actually prefers just the thinner lightweight material like this where it's not padded I will probably be getting a chest plate from another shop and using that on here just so the front area is padded when she starts doing forward momentum I don't want this area like digging into her but it's really hard for a biothane shop to make like a decent chest plate out of biothane. So yeah, anyways, that's the harness. They did put a little tag that says it's from Dino Dog Gear on the thing, which I like, oh my gosh, that's amazing. Um, and they did do another little like handwritten thank you on there. Uh, so yeah. I like the girth strap and how it has like enough space where say like she fluctuates on girth a little bit so if she like happens to be a bit smaller I could poke some extra holes down here and have that it's not like there's no space for that I also really like how they curve their edges because a lot of biothane shops I've seen recently just like cut it and that's it um and I'm like, I don't like how it looks because the edges aren't always even. They're not always clean looking. And this just makes them super nice and clean. I also personally love, I'm going to show you guys on the pull strap because I feel like that's better. They use rivets instead, or Chicago screws instead of rivets. So they're a little bit more sturdy. And then I know that they're, they were like still trying to figure out their harness um, style there for a while. And I was like talking to them and everything through the order process because I did put this one in before I put my second one in. And right before they started making mine, they finally kind of figured out what they wanted to do and they've started gluing their Chicago screws so they're not going to fall out and you can't like unscrew them easily at least. And yeah, I personally, I'm just like, I think they look like it looks so nice and sleek I think this is going to look amazing on Athena I'm not going to be putting it on her on this like in this video because she is gear shy and I don't want to stress her out and her end up hating this harness I have to introduce it a specific way I do have a short video on how to introduce gear to gear shy video or gear shy dogs which I can link if anybody's interested but yeah there's it with the pull strap I went ahead and put that in I may get a matching traffic lead and a white pull strap as I said so that maybe I could have like the white pull strap with like the white counterbalance handle if I want a little bit less gold but I think this looks so good like I am so in love with it I adore this like I cannot wait for my next one and I am most likely going to be buying a couple more from them now that I've sold a couple harnesses and would kind of like to revamp my collection a little bit but yeah as I said absolutely in love this is amazing all right 
So anyways, that's all I have for today. I hope you guys enjoyed and really liked this video as well. And yeah, so bye-bye.